coming at you today with a three blaster box break. Uh, as you guys saw, I'm doing the whole Stranger Things cards thing um, and trying to just buy those up wherever I can find them. Uh, they're in very short supply. And hey, when you do that, you uh, usually have to buy just well, a couple more things and then suddenly it's free shipping. So it's a good business decision to buy more baseball cards. And uh, a lot of these are starting to come down in price. So these are going on sale. Uh, so I will do Diamond Kings, which you guys know is one of my favorite uh, recent lines. And then we'll touch on Stadium Club, some great artwork in there, just great photography. And we'll end it off with Chrome. So we'll get it started out right here with 2017 Diamond Kings, and the other two boxes are 2018. Jim Bottomley. Hmm, what a proper British Bottomley name. Daniel Murphy. All right, card turned, card turned around. Jacob DeGrom, it is a framed card. Cool. We have originals. Rhino, Ryan Sandberg, and Steven Strasberg. A couple of neat ones in there. So on the cusp of free agency, exciting times. This is when baseball gets Extra exciting for me. I like love the off-season action. Mookie Betts turned around. Kirby Puckett, memorable moment. Walk-off homer in Game Six. Oh man, I do remember that series. These are all turned around. Bambino, John McGraw, boy, legendary player, and Carl Erskine. It's so bizarre and cool when you find cards that. Uh, have really unconventional players on it. Like, I don't even know who that guy is. And I'm kind of a nerd for baseball and old school baseball. So, the name that, the reason, the, the fact that that name isn't even vaguely familiar to me means I'm going to learn something <laughs> when I go through these. Uh, Joe DiMaggio, Didi Gregorius, Nolan Arnado, Bob Feller, Heritage Collection, and Gabriel Inoa. There are some really unique autographs in this set, which, man, it'd be a long shot. I, I should just buy a hobby box eventually of this set. Leo DeRocher, Will Myers, oh, the Ted Williams collection. I think I actually got that exact card before, um, which is kind of a bummer. Uh, we've got Robbie Cano, Seattle, nice. And Miguel Sano. Speaking of Seattle, well, first off, shout out to M's fan, uh, 89. Just was reading that they were considering a straight up tear down rebuild in Seattle. We'll see. Could be could be a very active off season out in the Pacific Northwest. Roger Maris, Bryce Harper, Tommy Henrik, Pudge. Oh boy, and they got him with the White Sox too. Carlton Fisk, legend, and Anthony Rizzo. So, I'll take a look at that. Usually, the fact that it's turned around gives a little bit of an indication, but usually if it's a circular frame instead of a square, it means this is a short print. So I'll look into that one. Two packs left. Ah, Johnny Pesky. Andy Pettit. Ernie Banks. Originals, Wade Boggs. I just, I do love the artwork on these cards. Uh, Carlos Asque. Harry Breachin. Trevor Story. Albert Pujols. Lou Gehrig, memorable moment. Four homers in a game. And Matt Carpenter. So, yeah, I think, I mean, this is my, just my second blaster box of these. So it's not like I've opened tons and tons of them. But uh, more and more, I, I'm starting to see the value of hobby packs or hobby boxes. Just to have those guaranteed hits, it, it's more exciting when you get a an autograph or a relic just in a random pack. But uh, yeah, I don't know. For not that much more money, ultimately, you can make sure that you get something cool. So I'm kind of starting to change my tune on it. So let's go over to Stadium Club. Stadium Club I haven't bought too much of. I think I bought just one individual hanger pack when it first came out. Um, 
just because these guys don't really do relics, they don't have as much going on. A lot of the uh, Gary Cole, Yadier Alonso, um, a lot of the, um, what was I getting at? Oh yeah, a lot of the autographs aren't really big name people. Clint Frazier, a lot of rookies, which that'll happen, and that's Beam Team, rookie card, that's a cool one. Nick, Nicholas Castellanos, and now there's a guy who broke out recently. Lance McCullers, beautiful photo. That's that's actually the, the big highlight to me in the stadium club is the photography. Photography, printing, they're nice and glossy. They feel very high end. Anthony Banda, rookie card. Jake Arrieta, got Don Mattingly, Edwin and Encarnacion, nice shot, <laughs> that's a great picture, Salvi Perez, I think he likes his life. I got to see if they have short prints and parallels in here, I haven't looked into that, but that kind of picture with Salvi would usually be a, a prime example for a short print. All right, very cool. Corey Seager. Nick, Nico Goodrum. We have, ooh, what do we got? Chipper Jones, never compromise. The insert sets are cool. I, I should give them credit. Wow. <laughs> More fun with Yassi, Yassi El Puig. And to finish this Dodgers friendly pack, we got Jock Peterson there. Boy, I cannot believe how LA got just wiped out of the World Series. I knew, I knew the Red Sox were favored and understood it, but uh, I thought the Dodgers would put up a much better fight than they did. Gary Sanchez. Adam Duvall. Cameron Maben. Kenley Jansen. Very Dodgers friendly box. And Orlando Arcia. Now what will become of Orlando Arcia? Uh, Highly touted prospect. He had an awesome playoff. Uh, he found a power stroke and was a difference maker despite batting around the Mendoza line all season long. Jose Barrios. Luis Gahara. Rookie card. Very nice. We got both of the Seeger boys now. Here's Kyle Seeger. Power zone, Manny Machado. Now, my team, the White Sox, are linked again to Manny Machado. I think that's such a long shot. Ryan Braun, getting some good brewers in here, too. Um, I mean, come on. I, I, I really don't think the White Sox get Manny Machado, and I honestly hope they don't. I, uh, I didn't really know too much about him other than that he was a good player until getting to see him play a lot during the playoffs, and yeah, he's kind of an a-hole, right? Nolan Arenado. And yes, I am of the, that looked like it was red, but it's not just reflection. Um, I am of the opinion that I'd rather have players I like than players who are great. Uh, George Brett, Matt Carpenter. Ooh, Stadium Club Chrome, George Springer. That is cool. Let's see, is that numbered? Doesn't look like it. It is an insert. The numbering is different on the back. Eddie Rosario. Boy, there's a lot of candids in, in um, Kind of photos from between the game action in, in this photo series, which is pretty neat. Something different. Robbie Cano, once again. Sean Manea. Special Forces, Clayton Kershaw. Jay Bruce. And Brett Gardner. Now, there's something kind of epic about the photography here. I mean, it's very shallow depth of field, making the background extra blurred out. Uh, yeah, I don't know, very cinematic feel. And our final pack of Stadium Club, John Smoltz. J.P. Crawford. There we go. Jose Abreu. Finally get a white sock. Mike, oh, there's Fulte. All right. Mike Fulton or what's uh, Matt Chapman. So there is our special packs of chrome there. Set that off to the side. All 
Okay. Alex Reyes. Freshman Flash, Harrison Bader. And that last autograph, um, other than that recent hobby box I pulled, was a random, like, 99 cent pack, and I got a Harrison Bader signed rookie card, which I'm still excited about. Oh, cool. First time I got one of these. I, I did buy a, a Yohan Moncada negative off of eBay, but here's first time I pulled one, Max Kepler. And Matt Olson. And there is no numbering on the chrome, although or the negative, although it is a thicker, thicker card than normal. I don't know. I, I feel like I've watched so many people open these packs online that I ended up not even wanting to get involved with the series. I was getting getting sick of them just from watching other people open them. But now that I'm <laughs> they're in my hand, they're pretty cool. Aaron Alther. Cody Allen, rookie card, Anthony Banda, and Nick Castellanos. I am doing the, uh, trying out just for a couple weeks, the keto diet, that's like non-carb, and uh, has anybody else out there tried that? Doing all right, but man, energy is flatlining. This is a nice Glaber Torres rookie. Reese Hoskins rookie throwback design, that is cool. That's maybe the best card of this box so far. Rafael Iglesias and Tim Beckham. I think Tim Beckham just got DFA'd, right? Or is maybe he's in danger of kind of just being released outright. Iglesias, one of the last trade ships the Reds currently have. And go Victor Robles, rookie. Walker Bueller, rookie. I like that a lot. Andrew Benatendi, future star. Will Myers. Okay, Brian Anderson, a rookie with the Marlins. Miguel Gomez, rookie. Alex Colome, which is a uh, prism, I think they call it. It's been a long time since I was knowledgeable about this one. And Zach Grinke. Prism, not numbered. Will I get a single numbered card between these three boxes? We'll see. And will I get better at opening packs? The time is running out on that. Pujols. Marwin Gonzalez, who I think is a free agent now. Mike Trout, you always like a trout. And Kenley Jansen. Boy, the uh, Dodgers are very well represented in these last two boxes. There we go. <laughs> this, I've always been a fan of the Speed Demons, the Burners, and the, uh, the great outfielders. And I've seen so many people pull this card. I, I've wanted it just because it's such a great shot, especially in chrome. That red is so hot. Uh, so finally, happy to get that Billy Hamilton card. Paul Goldschmidt, one of my favorites. And this is neat. Chris Bryant, superstar sensation. Finally, Jose Barrios. That's a fun pack. All right, finally. The four Sepia Refractor cards. Francisco Lindor. Can't get too much better than that. Let's see if he wins the MVP this year. Max Fried, rookie. Manny Margot. And Kyle Seeger. Kind of wish it was Corey. No offense, Kyle, but. Okay, again, you know, went through all of them. No, no actual hits, no autographs or relics, but uh, fun cards nonetheless. So, uh, end up with this Jacob deGrom framed one. And Rhino, you always gotta love when you get Ryan Sandberg. Just grew up watching him. One of the all-time greats. All right, well, thanks for watching. And uh, I have a whole bunch of Bowman, actually. <laughs> Some. Uh, bigger jumbo packs, not packs, but uh, boxes, mega box, whatever, um, that we will dig into sometime soon. That one's kind of burning a hole on me. I uh, can't wait to get to it. But I hope everybody's having a good November and staying warm, and I'll see you all soon.